let me tell you something. I might get a lot of things wrong on here. <clears throat> I might get a lot of predictions wrong. I might call the wrong shots. Oh, hold up. TV's in there. I'm not getting copyrighted. All right, there we go. But I just called that shit. That's the best thing I've ever called that actually happened. All right. First of all, I want to say that I think the world title match lasts probably about 10 minutes itself. Mark Henry versus Mark uh, Big Show. I think it lasted about 10 minutes. And that was it. And um, Big Show won, actually. He, uh, he knocked Mark Henry out. <clears throat> all right. First of all, because it's so short, I'll tell you what happened. Big Show took every ring. There was like five chairs on each side of the ring. Big Show took all the chairs and threw them in the ring. And then, you know, eventually went back and forth. And then, like, ten minutes later, Big Show knocked Mark Henry out and pinned him one, two, three, and won the world title. So, Big Show put it on. Now, first of all, that was his first world title win in nine years. <clears throat> Big Show threw it. Big Show threw the title on his belt, was celebrating, and then got hit in the back by Mark Henry with a chair. And Mark Henry just beat him up and beat him up with a chair. And then he did a whatever slam on a chair and knocked Big Show out. Then this, this is what I'm proud of because I called this. You guys can look back and you can see it. Now, I might have been wrong about Mark Henry winning his big show one, but I was right about this. You can look back and I posted this in my predictions. I said that Daniel Bryan would cash in his Money in the Bank briefcase on this night at this pay-per-view in this match, and it happened. Because the second uh, <clears throat> Triple H, uh, wow, big show was knocked out. Daniel Bryan's music hit. He came down to the ring, cashed in the money in the bank briefcase, pinned Big Show, Big Show, one, two, three, and he won the world title. Ladies and gentlemen, Daniel Bryan, whether you like it or not, is your new world heavyweight champion. <clears throat> okay? And this time, there's a big black lady in the back saying, what the fuck happened? You know? Um, so, what is that? Oh, it's their new show. They came out with like What's a it, like reality show. Life? Yeah, it's like No life. fucking way! Okay. On their new network. They just announced the first show. The first show for the WWE Network. It's called Legends House. It's going to be like Surreal Life, but for WWE Legends. They all just live in this house together for a while. That's insane. I want to see that. Um, although I can't because... Uh, Comcast... Wants to be a bunch of pricks. Just saying. But anyway, I called that shit. You guys can look back at the predictions. I called it. All right. <clears throat> and Jesse, I'm gonna tag you in this, man. You say my predictions are shit. I suck at what I do, man. I say this with love because you're one of my good friends. But fuck you. Proved you wrong tonight, didn't I? Huh? I have one wrong prediction out of all these matches. One wrong prediction. They're replaying Booker T versus Cody Rhodes. Give me one second so I can fill you in. Still beating him up. Showing Booker T coming out to the ring now and getting attacked by Cody Rhodes. Just got attacked by Cody Rhodes. Slammed him to the barricade. Punching him, punching him, punching him, punching him, punching him. I'm well, trying to get this under control. Obese guy like 400 pounds on him. Come on, update yourself. All right, Booker T's mad and he's got the grangey grange. You know what? I'll tell you in the next video. Anyway, I called it. Yeah, buddy. All right, later. Orange guy. Orange guy.